What's up guys, Tuber Tutorials here and I'm back with another Blackberry app review and this app is a file manager app, it's not free, it's $1.99 but it is the best file manager app there is. The Blackberry file manager app is good but if you, if you have Android apps and if you have the Kindle and you use the Wall Street Journal, what your playbook will do, it will download every picture from the Wall Street Journal and it will save it on your device and it will take up space. The thing is that it, those pictures will show in your file manager but it won't show on your desktop and if you're going to delete those pictures in your file manager you have to delete them one by one by one. So imagine you have to delete a thousand and whatnot pictures one by one. It's going to take forever but with this file manager you just do it in just a matter of second, just like you do it on a computer. You can also make new folders, you can delete folders, you can copy and paste, and you can move files. So the app is called My File Manager. All right, let's go into it. And you're greeted by this very simple design. Let's go to the top. You have, let's have focus for a minute. All right, you have new folder, delete folder, select all, deselect all, move, copy, share, hide, delete. You can zip folders, you can rename. At the side, you got the tilted, deselect, detailed. That's to change it from image to detail, just like on your computer, and refresh. If you scroll down from the top, it just gives you a settings that nothing is really there to change just to enable password yes you can password protect it or show thumbnails for hidden files so um i'm just gonna if if you're watching this and you have the wall street journal for the kindle on here i'm just gonna quick quickly show you where to go to delete those unwanted photos that you can't delete if you plug it into the computer you have to go to your playbook media shared all right then you got to go to MICS, all right, go to Android, and it's going to show you all your, uh, oops, just went back there, let's go back, it's going to show you all your Android apps. Now, if you downloaded the Wall Street Journal, this folder should come up, WSJ External Data Cache, that is where all those unwanted pics are on, so you can either click on the folder and delete folder or just click on these two subfolders and go to files and it will show you I delete I did it all of my all of mine so you won't see them but you would have like thousands and thousands of pictures and templates you just hit select all and then hit delete and voila you delete everything in just one second all right but if you don't have the Wall Street Journal um it you're your the Android player also takes pictures from your Twitter. If you have Twitter for for Android, it also takes all your Twitter um contacts pictures and save it. So you also need this to delete them as well because those pictures are not visible when you plug it into your computer. They're kind of hidden files, which do take up space on your device. So I'm going to show you the features at the top. So it's it's just like your computer. It's just like when you USB to your computer. It's the same thing. Let's go into photos. And something that your native BlackBerry 5 manager can't do is move, copy, paste, and make new folders. Um, so let's go into photos. And uh, I created this folder. And let's make a new folder. Let me, sh let me show you that it actually works. Let me delete this folder. We don't need that. All right. Did okay. All right. Folder is deleted. All right. Now let's make a new folder. You just click on new folder, and you're gonna give it a name. And let's call this. Um. Let's just call it fold all right hit ok then you're going to hit new folder right here and then voila it makes your new folder so that's a focus there 
makes your new folder called fold now let's test if it actually works let's go to our pictures here and we're going to see if that folder is actually there and all right so it, it won't it won't show up if you don't have a picture in there I just real, realized that you need to put something in the folder before it shows up so let's go into that new folder let's go into fold but we got to put something in there so let's go back so this will give me the time to show you how to copy and move files pretty easy let me go into my designs let me go into my wallpaper folder here and let's see I want to move this image and if you want to preview a file you just long press just hold down on it and it's going to open up the file in your picture app so let's go back to this alright so let's say we want to um, move this into a new folder just click on it it adds a check mark right there alright and then go at the top and you can hit move and then it's going to it's going to give you a little small box that's your folder um location click on those dot dot dots and choose a folder so let's put it into our new folder called fold and let's hit move and it says you have successfully moved it hit okay now let's go back to our pictures i'm going to show you that it actually works and find it and there's our new folder fold and there's a picture that we just put inside the folder so that's show you that it works you can also do that with documents you can make new folders you can move documents and all that so if you're like me and you have a lot of files that you want to move but you can't do it because the playbook file manager does not give you the the necessary things to do it with you have to plug it into your computer and do it from the computer get this app and you can do everything right on the playbook without even plugging the playbook into your computer so um that's it for the review guys i know the video is kind of long but this app is really in-depth and i really advise you to get it it's only 199 on the app store two dollars so go buy it download it and get rid of that old file manager that comes with the playbook and use this one so that's my file, my file manager for the BlackBerry Playbook. Thank you guys for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Tour tutorials. Peace out.